Hi, I'm Rod Atkins with Sitco Water. I'm here with Todd Fox, our marketing manager. We're going to do a demonstration on the difference in technologies with an electromagnetic meter or a mag meter and a multi-jet meter. We're going to show the difference of the positioning or the orientation of a meter setting and how it affects each product. What we've got here is meter settings that are really what you'll see in the real world where we have meters set going up a hill or it could be inverted and going down a hill and how it affects the setting. What we're going to demonstrate is the effect of orientation on these two products. The electromagnetic meter is not affected at all in any position where the multi-jet or a single jet meter would both be affected by the positioning of the water meter. The mag meter continues to run, the multi-jet's not registering at all, and we're simulating a 10 gallon per hour leak. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take these setters and put them in a plumb and level position and catcher both registers. So here we go, without changing the flow rate, I now have both meters in a plumb and level position. As you can see, the orientation of the setting greatly affected the multi-jet meter and had no effect on the electromagnetic meter. So that applies to vertical, it could be cantered or leaned in any direction. Any position change in this meter, this multi-jet, will affect the way that it registers, where the electromagnetic product can be set in any orientation.